usually on St. Patrick's Day we have a nice um, Irish meal, like Irish stew and some side dishes. Like last year I made so many side dishes. I, I can't even remember all the stuff I made, but I made like a giant huge meal. I was in the kitchen for hours. Yeah, I have a little BB-8. I got a little BB-8 pot vinyl. Isn't he adorable? Good morning guys and happy St. Patrick's Day. There's a storm system coming through so none of us are feeling that great. So I didn't sleep last night and so she's rest napping. I just got up like a hour and 45 minute nap and I don't know what about everyone else. Mom's been trying to be productive but I just don't feel that great. The Nap did help with pain levels somewhat. <laughs> I was having a lot of nerve pain in my neck and stuff, and that's not as bad now. But I still do not feel well. In some ways, I actually feel worse about an hour after the nap. But I need to work on the blogs. But if I don't feel well, I'm going to rest for a while first. Watch some TV or play Overwatch. I don't know which. And see from there because I just don't feel well and I don't want to do a vlog right now. <laughs> but yeah, I. Um. It's St. Patrick's Day. I don't know if I said that. So I'm wearing green, this top, and then my leaf um, ring. My pill bag's falling over. But I played a little Oprah Watch with a friend this morning before they had to leave and they'll be back this evening so we'll put, try to play a little bit more together this evening so that'll be nice um we practice a lot together and so um helps to improve but i'm gonna go for now and i'll see all you hi guys so it's tomorrow and i promised you i would show you what we got at target today so i'm gonna do that first happy st patrick's day um i know Probably not everybody celebrates that, but um, I kind of like to, you know. It's a maybe small holiday, but it's fun. We usually make Irish stew and like some soda bread and stuff, but we didn't get around to that this year just because things have been a little bit hectic. Um, so yeah, um, we might do that soon. Um, just not today, my little busy. Um, we had to have somebody come and repair the van windshield because there was like this really bad crack going along the driver's side and um, we have to get inspected and so I don't think we had passed inspection like that. So that had to happen today and all that. So it's just, we brought ahead some stuff going on today. Oh, I need to take meds. All right. I have to try my, um, Zephyrin. I usually take thinner again, but we're gonna try some Zofran because my nausea has been bad for helping me use which meds will help. So, um, I'm gonna take those after I show you this. Okay, so, anyway. Get these. And this is my outfit for today. Yes, I am wearing suspenders. I like them. I think they're cute. It's a bit hard to show an outfit like this. Anyway. I would put stuff on, but it needs to be washed because it's not too It has like, you know, their detergents and stuff on it. So I can't put it on for you. So I'll just kind of like have to lay it out. Um, this here is first. It's a bit hard to kind of like show this. It's like a big sweater that's basically a blanket. <laughs> basically a sweater blanket. So it's just really pretty. It's by this line at Target. I think it's a newer line of theirs. And it's Knox Rose. Um, they had a lot of stuff out. 
there. That's what I focused. They had a lot of stuff of theirs yesterday. Seems like a newer line. But um, this was on clearance. We went to the clearance racks yesterday. And um, found this. And it was just looked really comfy. It's really hard to show this because of the way it's made. I'll try and show y'all sometime when somebody's wearing it. So there's this cute dress. It's just got it's sleeveless and it's got this really cute skirt on it. So it's a nice summery dress. And um, back here in the back, it's kind of it's got this nice little detail at the back with these little buttons and just almost a sort of little collar. So it's really cute. It's like a high collared dress and it's a nice little summer dress, which I like. Um, I like I like wearing dresses. I just don't have many of them. And so I'm trying to sort of collect them. Um, so I can just have a nice nice dress collection because I am a dress kind of person. I just don't have many. Because, um, you know, like really long dresses can just get kind of too formal. So I just kind of want some that I can wear whenever, you know. Because I do like summery dresses and all those. I can be a bit frilly at times. <laughs> Case in point, my outfit today. Um, okay, and then this, I am like so excited for this because I have been wanting something like this for so long. Um, this is, yes, a velvet dress. This is like um, a sort of skater dress, maybe just a little bit longer. Um, it's a long sleeve black velvet dress. <laughs> I was so excited. I got this at the clearance store for like $7. Um, it's got that sort of similar detail on the last dress back here at the neck with a little loop bead. That's so you can get it over your head. Um, but I am so excited because I have been wanting a velvet dress like this for a long time. Um, I love velvet. It's like one of my favorite materials. Um, so I am just really excited. I mean, look at how pretty that is. Um, so I'm hoping maybe I can get at least one use out of it before, you know, spring and summer hit. I probably won't be able to, but, you know, a girl can help. Um, and then I got just two more things. I got, I really like this next one. Um, because I am a nerd. And um, I don't know if I've talked about it a ton on these vlogs. But, um, I love the Marvel Netflix series. Um, I don't really care for Iron Fist that much. <laughs> um, I feel like they, like, yeah, I don't, I don't feel like, I, I didn't care for that series. Um, and I don't feel like he, I feel like he didn't really do very well in the Defenders. But that's just my opinion. Um, you know, it's just me, like. Um, but I mean, I love Daredevil and Jessica Jones and Nick, Nick Cage, wait, Luke Cage, I said Nick Cage, Luke Cage, dang it. Well, <laughs> I do love Nick, Luke Cage. Um, weird brain, brain fog there. But uh, anyway, so, um, I got this Defenders t-shirt, it was also on the print rack, and, um, it's really comfy material, and I was just really excited when I got that, when I saw that there. Um, because there are so few, um, just superhero t-shirts out there with women on them. I mean, like, I'm not even kidding you. I mean, you can find so many Avenger t-shirts out there, and there's no Black Widow. I mean, you can find Wonder Woman t-shirts, but aside from Wonder Woman these days, there's just no females on superhero t-shirts. And so, um, it was just kind of nice and it's to see Jessica on there um so yeah you know she'd probably hate being a role model but <laughs> she's not necessarily a role model just exciting to see a woman on there um and then this I got a Star Wars t-shirt so excited I don't have any Star Wars like t-shirts I have a BB-8 he's actually falling off his hand I just noticed yeah I have a little BB-8 I got a little BB-8 pop vinyl. Isn't he adorable? Um, I have him. But he's like all I have, Star Wars merch-wise. So I found this is also over there for like uh, $4. And 
And so, yeah, we got that. And uh, Mama got a dress, which she might show you. But uh, yeah, that's what I got. So I'm really excited about that. And there's some nice clothes, and I'm super ready to focus. But that's for my day. I'm going to probably do my daily exercises, some reading, and then maybe try and do some writing. And I'll probably do some gaming later tonight. And yeah. So that's about it. I'll show you all that. And I hope y'all are having a good day. I hope y'all had a good St. Patrick's Day because by the time you see this, St. Patrick's Day will be over. So I hope you're having a good uh, Monday. Mm -hmm. I hope you're having a good Monday. <laughs> so I'm not feeling good. I laid down for a nap after I had tried um, broadcasting some gameplay and it wasn't working because I was just in high pain and I couldn't focus. So I lay down and ended up sleeping through two entire episodes of Monk and like a quarter of an hour episode. <sighs> but I'm awake and I'm going to wait for a bit. Played a few more games. Did better since I wasn't in so high pain. In high pain now though. Um, and now since I'm feeling really bad, I've switched to watching anime. So I watched episode 22 of... Um, The Ancient Magnus's Bride, which I cried so much, and now watching, um, episode 40, um, which is season, so the episode, season 2, episode, whatever, I don't remember how many episodes were in season 1, so, um, this is probably like, um, I don't know, but it's a says 40, so, um, it would depend on how long season two was, which episode this is, season, I mean, how long season one was this, which episode of season two this is, but it's close to the end of season two, so I'm sad it's going to be over soon, but, um, did I say what it was? Um, March Comes in Like Lion, which is a really good anime about Shoji, which is Japan's version of chess and depression and bullying and, um, growing up and family and it's a really friendship and it's just a really really good anime it's like a masterpiece guy seriously i'm not joking at all when i say that i'm full serious it's a masterpiece um uh, so yeah i'm feeling like really nauseous right now i ate some lunch i just got a peanut butter and jelly sandwich because i am not feeling good and standing for long is not working so yeah um Usually on St. Patrick's Day we have a nice um, Irish meal, like Irish stew and some side dishes. Like last year I made so many side dishes. I, I can't even remember all the stuff I made, but I made like a giant huge meal. I was in the kitchen for hours and it was so delicious. I wish I could do that this year, but it's not happening. I mean, I still haven't been able to make can I and Caroline's birthday desserts. I'm really hoping I can make some this weekend. We'll see. Maybe tomorrow if the storms are better. I don't know when they're exactly they're hitting. I just know they're hitting sometime this weekend. But I'm going to go rest and watch more anime, so see y'all in a bit. I don't even remember how much I filmed today, guys. But honestly, I'm not feeling good. I was going to catch up on the vlog, but I decided not to because I didn't, couldn't hold my laptop because I was having, I've been having gallbladder attacks all day. At night and it's been painful. Thankfully the pain's finally under control. I focused on eating low fat foods, um, didn't drink coffee, didn't drink stevia, um, anything I know that would set off, like I don't, didn't eat tomatoes or there's a lot of things that could set off gallbladder pain so I didn't eat or drink any of those which was bothersome. But I had a bagel and I had some dairy free um, so delicious yogurt and apple juice because apple juice and can help with gallbladder attacks. I even put a little ACV or apple cider vinegar in some apple juice because um, for years mama has used it to stop gallbladder attacks and for like probably 20 years and I tried it and it did help so I'm very thankful for that but I'm not feeling good but I'm happy because I've been playing Overwatch, made some new friends so that was great and I um, won a lot of games. 
So that was really fun. My voice is almost hoarse now. It's very sore. Because I've been, um, when I play comp, I always use, um, the microphone so I can coordinate with my team. And so my voice is sore. <laughs> but it was a lot of fun. It was helpful to get through the gallbladder tracks. I mean, at times I was, like, bending over, saying, ow, ow, while gaming. But thankfully they all put it up with it. They understood that I'm ill. So, I... I had a lot of fun, and I'm very, very happy about that, despite the gallbladder attacks. I'm happy that the gallbladder attacks, at least, aren't a usual everyday symptom for me. I mean, I get gallbladder, it's like gallbladder pain, but it's usually not this bad. So, I don't know why it was bad. Apparently, one of my friends is with another friend of hers in the hospital because her gallbladder was so bad, and she was, um, is going to have a gallbladder out tonight. Tomorrow, so my friend is there to help her, which she's a really good friend, and she's really friendly, actually. So, I don't know, it's weird. I wonder if the weather sets me off, so I wonder if the weather was worsening. Uh, I don't know, it's weird how it affects the barometric pressure shifts, affects things very oddly. But I really will try to catch up on vlogs when I just I have not been feeling good, guys, and it's made my motivation very low. <laughs> Especially because I've gotten out of the habit. It's, that's a large problem. It's I got out of the habit, and so my motivation to do it is harder to find than when I'm in the habit. So, I don't know. But I hope you all had a good St. Patrick's Day. I was hoping I could do uh, Since I couldn't make my St. Patrick's Day traditional Irish meal, I was hoping I could at least make some custard kits that's easy to make and I could make it for everyone's diets but alas my gallbladder attack got worse and I wasn't able to stand so nope custard but that's okay um anyways I'm gonna get some sleep so thank you guys for watching if you enjoyed this vlog please give it a thumbs up and I will see you tomorrow good night Bye.